Howdy. I came across these two amazing cosplayers. You can see pictures above and below of their work. And I saw them all day, and you, you both garnered pretty good attention around the con. Because yeah. you're just so pretty and detailed. Thank it's just, you. Uh, um, so, do you mind introduce yourself and tell me about your costume? I'll start with you. Uh, well, my name is Toasty, and we made all these costumes ourselves together, and we suffered a lot. <laughs> and that's about it. And I'm Spooky. Um, yeah, we slaved over this. There's a lot of detail. We hand glued all the rhinestones and all the sequins, and it was just a lot of effort for a really fun costume. Cool. We were proud. Now, I'm not sure what this is. Is this like a, an actual uh, from anime or like beautiful Lolita? <laughs> well, um, it's from Love Live, which is like an anime and video game series. So it's like a mobile rhythm tap tap game. Okay. And there's like specific like cards you can collect and. And different outfits, and these are those outfits. Cool. Mm -hmm. All right. So, Love Live. I hear about this a lot. At all the cons I go to, there's always a bunch of women dressing up, doing it, and these beautiful outfits. But I've, I've just yet to watch it or play it. What What about Love Live drew you in? I'll start with you. Um, I actually really suck at rhythm games, but I found that Love Live was easy enough for me, okay. and I really liked. The songs. All the songs are so much fun to sing along with and play. It's really fun. And the anime is good too. Okay. What about you? Um, well, I really enjoy rhythm games, so when I heard about Love Live, I was just like, there's cute girls and cool music, so it was just the best of both worlds. So I was like, let's get on that. And here we are. <laughs> so, um, what got you into like, game, like, what was. Are you, would you say you're both more anime fans or gaming fans? How, how did this all start off for you? Um, I started off watching, uh, I mean, playing games first. Okay. So, like, anything Nintendo was really good for me, and Bioshock definitely drew me into the cosplay scene. So, yeah, I wanted to cosplay the Little Sisters. That was, like, my first ever dream cosplay. So, and I kind of just started watching anime because I found a manga in, um, a library or like public library back home so that's how I got into it and what about you how'd you get into the cat this I started watching anime first cuz um, I don't know I picked up a manga in the local library and it just got me into this whole world of creating characters that are fictional and bringing them to real life which is what cosplay is about for me really wonderful so leading into that what was the first anime you ever watched that just drew you into the world <laughs> uh, mine was Shugo Chara. It's a very uh, girly anime about okay. like becoming your true self. And I was like, that's what I want. Middle school me was like, yeah. goals. I want to cosplay Shugo. I think one of my first ones was Sailor Moon. So oh, I, I, could, I could never give anyone any grief for anything. He was like, the little boy, like, oh my god, that's so cool. That's so pretty. <laughs> so cool. What about you? Um, it's Kamichama Karen. There's a lot of like slack about it because the art style is very ugly and outdated. It's like the huge anime eyes that take up like 80% yeah. of their face. But it was about magical girls, so I was very excited as a small child. <laughs> um, what was the one anime you watched that touched you so much, that really gave you the feel so much, that you wish everyone got into? Mine is obviously Neon Genesis Evangelion. Um, I have a tattoo from them. It's my favorite anime. It's just, it's really deep and emotional, and there's robots. Cool. So, two good things. What about you? Um, my favorite anime of all time is uh, Your Lie in April. It's about like a bunch of musicians who come together, and it's just very sad. And as someone who used to play the piano, it would just touch me. So. I'm a big fan, and I recommend it to anyone who wants a good cry. Cool. <laughs> All right, now, I asked you both the same question. What is your absolute, money's not object, dream cosplay? And then, what is your dream group cosplay? Wow. Oh, okay. All right, who's ready to start? I guess I'll go first. All right. I know. So my dream cosplay is uh, this 
plug suit Rey Ayanami from Neon Genesis Evangelion. And then I guess my dream cosplay would be the dancer set from Love Live. It's an Arabian Nights themed, very belly dance-esque. Okay. So it's cute. Cool. What about you? Um, my dream would be uh, Biva or like diva from overwatch with like the huge mech and everything too if i could okay. but that's like out of my realm but um yeah a dream group cosplay would also be the dancer set uh we just really love that set it's really pretty <laughs> all right now you both have gotten a lot of attention today deservedly so because both of your outfits the more i look at you the more i see the little details and extra steps uh -huh. and that takes a lot of effort and work and i'm glad you're getting a positive reception but what do you say to someone who's looking at you like, oh my God, they're both so beautiful, they're both so confident, they're both dressed so nice, I, I wish I can do that, but I can't. What do you tell the shy person who wants to start to cosplay? I would just go into it, like that's what I did. I didn't really have any assistance from anyone else, and we kind of just found each other through cosplay. Got our best friend through cosplay. Right <laughs> we do everything together, so I say just find a friend and go crazy. Cool. What about you? I say don't listen to the haters because I started off very unconfident in my sewing ability and my crafting ability. And then did you make this? Yeah, we made everything oh, by yeah. hand. We made wow. Everything. Yeah. These are beautiful. Thank you. These are seriously beautiful. <laughs> so just dive head first. Get into it if you're confident it'll show to everyone else, so just work hard. That's some great advice. Thank you both so much. No I problem. really appreciate this. <laughs>